What's up guys, it's your boy Liffy here. I wanted to come at you again with another build video. Um, actually super excited about this one. I know I've been getting a lot of traction, people coming back over to my Twitch channel um, talking about builds. So today was like pretty special in that regard. So I appreciate everybody hanging out over on Twitch. Uh, but we started doing some theory crafting, thinking of another build. And um, people are really liking the elemental in my AFK Devastator build, whatever you want to call it, which is cool. Um, so we were messing around with Frost, right? Since Frost is the new DLC element uh, in subject 2923. Um, and I couldn't really, we couldn't really like get something good going, right? Um, every time you're trying to use Frost, right? Uh, like there's blizzard blizzard feels really really clunky some people have said they like it like in smaller dungeon areas and i can't see that working and higher difficulties i don't know i haven't gotten it to play out very well cold spear which you can see up on the screen right now very strange um i played with it for, for a couple hours didn't like it at all but i came back to it and here's why there's one thing you need to keep in mind for frost and frozen right as you are getting frostbite i guess not frost frostbite built up on the enemy when they become frozen the enemies take increased crit damage okay i remember reading this somewhere i forgot where i saw it i forgot where i read it so we tested this out a little bit and uh it does indeed seem to be true um you can see that i i had a video that came out a few days back about the radiant crit build which was like complete dog crap um with the fusion rifle in my opinion i thought it was dog crap um, much better builds out there, right? If we're really trying to compare DPS. And um, so I was like, all right, well, let's try Frost getting frozen on the enemies, right? Which is very, very um, unstable to do. It's very difficult to do unless you're on a boss. So there's only one mod in the game that's guaranteed to get you the frozen effect on enemies right out the gate. It is Cold Spear. So as you can see, we're rocking with Cold Spear on the beam rifle. This build's crazy. And I wouldn't even like, no, I, there's no way you could have convinced me before I tried this that it would work. Okay, like no theory craft on paper that this would be like viable. It's just, it doesn't fit like the neurological gameplay of how you would play this game, right? And I know you guys are looking at the screen like, what the hell's going on? He's got one gun. I'm going to tell you, all right? And I'm going to tell you why I'm beam rifle. So Cold Spear, when you throw it and it hits an enemy, they blow up like really fast, right? Like 0.5 seconds. I don't know why my camera's flickering. I apologize about that. Um, and they get frozen effect on them, okay? So there's another mod ability, which I know a lot of you guys like. I love it too. Frozen Mist. Frozen Mist does do a lot of damage. It is fun to play with. But it doesn't really play into the whole getting the enemy frozen with crit damage. Now, you can do another build with, like, just the frozen mist in general for, like, mod damage and kind of play into that, which we did as well. So I'll probably come out with another video about that kind of um, play style, which is fun. Frozen mist is awesome. But this, you throw this bad boy on a boss, and they get frozen, which frozen lasts a while. O-M-G. Because not, o not only do we have increased crit crit damage um, with Cold Spirit and, and the enemy's frozen. Yo, this beam rifle start be, it, it be ticking up in the damage. I'm telling you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw in some clips on uh, Nightmare. And I think I have some clips on Apocalypse where I killed Gorefist. I got to go back and check the stream footage. Um, insane. Also, with this Cold Spirit... When they are frozen, it is almost works as a defensive ability. The monster, the NPC moves so freaking slow. Um, it, you have to change your dodge style, seriously. But it, oh, in a good way. In a good way. It's, it's great. So we're taking... You can really use any gun here, okay? But I found beam rifle, like, on bosses to be killer. Even on uh, NPCs, uh, you know, adds, like, the zone clear in, like, Apocalypse and Nightmare. It's great, too. Uh, but you can really take any gun here with Cold Spear. You really could, it, depending on what you want to play with. All right, um, it's awesome. So Frostborn, of course, with the with the melee weapon, just if you do have to do any melee attacks. But the problem is, you got to build up Frozen. Bro, this bad boy, boop, 
Got him. Frozen. Beam. Dead. Crit damage. Insane. I'm guessing based on the numbers I saw, about a 30% increase. I want to get this verified. So if somebody knows the exact crit damage increase that they take, I want to say in between like 20 and 30%. All right, and I'm sure it varies, right? Based on the build. Um, yeah, other than that, the rest of the build, armor-wise, radiant, self-explanatory. We're just going with as much crit as possible. Um, yeah, same with your traits. You're going to take crit traits, um, all of that good stuff. And um, you know what? Here, let me change two seconds. Let me change my overlay. We're going to go with the notepad here, here in just a second. Uh, yeah, so we're taking radiant. Alrighty, boys. So I was, I, I we were, we were, uh, theory crafting some of this. Okay. So necessity, necessity. You got to take a uh, cold spear. All right. Um, it, it, it just plays a million times better than the rest of the other stuff. Um, okay. Radiant armor. Three piece possibly a two-piece radiant and one-piece cultist if you struggle with the cold spear you can look at my some of my notes up there at the top too okay right here white rose on amulet uh you get this from non-consecutive uh survival boss kills by the way I don't know the number. You're going to have to look it up. I forgot. It's like 125 or something like that. I'm not a genius, okay? Just know some of this stuff. All right? And the goal here is... Uh, we're going to say the goal... Stack crit and crit damage as much as possible. Um, and, and attack frozen enemies ASAP. Meaning... We need them to freeze ASAP. Um, that is the goal here. And that's why we take Cold cold Spear. Cold Spear in and of itself does not do good damage. All right. So w that's why it steers so many people away. And it steered me away for the longest time. Um, but I figured it out. This thing was beasting. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put in some clips and stuff. So hopefully the video doesn't go too long. All right. So I got to wrap this up. Um, then we're gonna take braided thorns. This is a flex spot. Can change it in and out uh, depending on item sets. I have some rings that I still need to work on, so I might change it. Right, um, devouring loop necessary uh, for the insane crit crits, which you will see. Um, you will get some insane crits on that um i think all of these are are necessary i'm sorry let me put let me put uh braided thorns down here we'll say this is flex not necessary but very good all right and that's what we're gonna rock with other than that i don't see too much diversity in this real quick reason we're going with white rose all right if you read White Rose, 25% damage for each unequipped firearm. All right. I tried this with, I, I like, I tried this opposite, right? I, I, I tried to take more damage, maybe more mod damage in the, in the amulet, right? Run with the pistol, run with frozen mist and cold spear, and then kind of like alternate and do a little bit of mod damage uh, while having like a hunting pistol for like some headshots and things like that. The damage itself didn't make up for it. It just didn't make up. The, the, I could not get an enemy or a boss on a higher difficulty frozen fast enough with anything other than Cold Spear. So I noticed myself only being in my main, uh, only being in one gun, whichever gun had Cold Spear. And with that, it did enough crit and uh, crit damage. And I just ultimately resolved on like beam rifle. And 25% damage in and of itself is insane. And that's across the the freaking board. 25% damage on everything, right? So if you do the math and you really start fighting a boss, um, you can try another build with a different amulet. Um, but I'd be very curious to see like the difference between your crit damage um, during that boss fight when like when the enemy's frozen. Um, 
from White Rose versus anything else because um, every time I compared it, White Rose killed everything out of the water. Um, it, it was just a much better play. And you really don't need another weapon because you're just going to be killing stuff so fast, even on Nightmare. I, so I, I typically run my, my chill playthroughs on Nightmare. If I'm really trying to push it, then I go Apocalypse, um, you know, streaming and stuff like that. So I'll show you guys some of those clips on all that. All right. Um, all right. That's it for that. Um, let me see if I have some other notes here. Some other things to note, we also tried to make up for that 25%, um, like with Blizz like I said, with Blizzard on another weapon, possibly running Song of Swords on that weapon, which is a 20%. The problem is, is you were in that weapon too much, Song of Stor Swords would not stay up long enough for you to get value out of that 20% damage gain. Um, and then, when you tried to freeze the enemy, Cold Spear's not up, then Sword Spear is not up, so, or Song of Swords is not up, and you have this constant rotation, um, and your 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 damage just falls off, right? So so White Rose is twenty five percent all the time, all the time. So twenty five percent White Rose, good to go. Um, and you can see some of my notes up there. I won't have to read it all. That was when we also tried Brutal Mark to see about under fifty percent, but with two weapons and Rung Song of Sword. Well, it, the math doesn't check out. You only get that 25% bonus under 50%. And that, that initial 50%, you're, you're swapping between Song of Sword. He's not frozen long enough. And, I, and it's, it just didn't work. If you, if, if you look at the crit damage, we tested it for hours and hours and hours. And I was, uh, my crit was like 40, 50 for, per shot with the beam rifle. Much, much higher. Just right out of the gate. So... Um, much more consistent damage. All right, boys. Um, thank you very much. Once again, you can follow me over on Twitch. Subscribe to this channel. Please, I, I see a lot of views. I love it, but uh, not much conversion. So if you really enjoy the content, um, please hit a like, subscribe, comment, something like that. Let me know what you want me to work on next. I'm more than happy to do all that stuff. Um, any feedback is good feedback, in my opinion. So yeah, hit me up. Reach out to the Discord. All that stuff can be found below. And uh, yeah, guys, I'm going to try to snip in some clips here uh, from the live stream. Um, so I apologize about some of the dialogue. I'll try to keep it short. Thank you, guys. We'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks. Bye-bye. You get it from survival boss kills? non-consecutive so it's like 125 i think it was so you just play that a lot still frozen Yo, I have to do this on Apocalypse. This is on Nightmare Boys, but oh my god. Dude, Frozen's OP. Fucking love it. Whoa. It's over. Better than the flop build, boys. Don't even run flop, okay? Just run this. That's it. That's all you need. For that reason. It's like insane. Yeah. Okay, so we can't kill him before the second phase, it looks no. like. Man. 
No, did that hit me? What? So much damage. So many good builds. It, 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 if you play on normal, it's all doable with like whatever you play with. You know, like I'm on Apocalypse right now, so a little bit different, but you know, running through the game with like the shotgun isn't bad. Using hunter armor, really strong offensively. Ah, oh, shit. Problem is, is like... Come on, baby. Oh shit. Oh, I got fucking lucky. Still frozen? Yeah. I'm in a bad spot. I'm in a bad spot. Anymore? All right, can we kill him right here? No! Oh, I was gonna stay. 